This video made possible by Buy Mobile. Hey everyone, welcome back to How Tech. Today we have a Samsung Galaxy S10, and we're gonna show you how to set up the fingerprint sensor. So one of the key features of this phone is the fact that it has a fingerprint sensor built into the screen. So right in here, there is an ultrasonic sensor which can do a 3D reading of your thumbprint and therefore be able to recognize your fingerprint. So it doesn't use the camera, doesn't use a special fingerprint sensor. It's actually just part of the screen and that's actually really cool. So let's cut to the chase and show you how to do that. So you wanna to go to the settings menu, so pull up and look for the gear. And then uh, you wanna to go to lock screen, which is in that second section down. It looks like a lock, of course. And now you have a choice of what type of settings to do on here. So if you go to lock sc screen lock type, you can see that the fingerprint sensors down here on the bottom and just toggle that on. And now you have to sort of train your fingerprint. So hit continue. So before we can set a fingerprint, we have to set some other things. So let's just do a pin and we'll make it uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then do okay. And do it again, one, two, three, four, five, six. So now you wanna scan your fingerprint. So let's just touch right here and place your finger, lift the finger and put it back down. So this is basically the same as, you know, any iOS device, etc. So now that I want different parts of your finger, so let's move it around. So now they want to get the full scan, so they want you to move your hand around even more. So let's try like this, like this this and fingerprint added okay so you can do more than one fingerprint of course so let's do done so now we're done and it brings us up to notifications okay no i don't agree okay so let's give it a try i just left it in the gallery so that you can tell if it's working or not and i'll lock the screen and now it's asking me to put my fingerprint there so i'll try my other finger first and you can see it reacts but it doesn't match Let's try the one that I matched and boom, actually pretty fast. Some people complain that this ultrasonic thing is not as fast as the previous fingerprint sensors. And that's probably true, but it actually is, seems to be pretty fast. Let's try it again. Again, we'll try it with a different finger, no match. Uh, let's try it with the right finger, even with the screen off. Boom, works. Okay, so I can't complain too much. I don't know about you guys. So it definitely fell the finger, just not the right one. And boom, works again. So uh, maybe I have good fingerprints or something, but totally works for me. I don't know about you. So that's basically how you set up the fingerprint sensor on the Samsung Galaxy S10. Of course, the facial recognition is similar as well. Uh, we won't go through that this time. So see you guys next time. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. If this helped you out, please give us a thumbs up. Definitely check out our other how-to videos for the Samsung Galaxy S10 and many other popular phones here on HowTex. Thanks and bye. This video made possible by buymobile.com.au. The card is here on the bottom right, and there's also a very small notch here on the bottom right as well. You guys can see that. Um, there's also... A